Yesterday, I told you about five areas of interest that you need to know about if you want to experiment with perturbation theory for yourself to see for sure that it works, or maybe you're going to find that it doesn't work. The first area of interest that I talked about, we can forget about today, because today we're going to learn what is a displacement node and what is a pressure node. Those even-numbered areas that I gave you, number two and number four, those are pressure nodes. The odd-numbered ones that I gave you, number three and number five, those are displacement nodes. So what do displacement nodes do and what do pressure nodes do? Well, your vocal tract has its own resonant frequencies. We call these formants. Formants are how anybody understands what vowel we're making, etc., etc. You, you use these a lot. Basically, it's your sound is made of the fundamental frequency and your formants. Anytime that you constrict a pressure node that was two and number four, you're going to lower the resonant frequency that's associated with that node. Anytime you expand at that same node, you're going to raise that same associated resonant frequency or formant. Anytime you constrict at a displacement node, you squeeze it and you make it more narrow, that's going to raise the corresponding resonant frequency or formant. And anytime you expand in the same place, you're going to have the opposite effect. You will lower that resonant frequency. This means that every formant, every resonant frequency, uses the whole vocal tract. Even though we can make some difference between the second formant, for instance, and the first formant by moving the tongue around, the actual tuning of our second formant uses all five of these areas that I talked about. It uses all four of the nodes that I talked about. That's going to be true for any resonant frequency in your vocal tract. It will include the three areas of interest from the first resonant frequency, but not necessarily anything from the second formant or anything else. But they all share the beginning and the end, so they are all affected by that.